What if I told you that not eating for three days could do more for your body than some of the most expensive therapies in the world? Sounds crazy, right? We've been raised to believe that constant nourishment equals health eat every few hours, never skip meals, snack to boost your metabolism. But what if the exact opposite is true? What if the constant eating we've been told is healthy is actually what is making us sick, tired, and overweight? The real culprit behind nearly every chronic illness including diabetes, cancer, and even stubborn weight gain isn't starvation. It's insulin resistance, and you don't develop insulin resistance by skipping meals. You develop it by eating too frequently, by constantly bathing your cells in insulin until they become resistant to it. High insulin blocks fat burning, stops cell repair, and even slows down your brain. That's why so many people who eat 5 or 6 small meals a day find themselves stuck their metabolism broken, their waistline growing, and their energy crashing. Now imagine flipping that script. Imagine giving your body a break from food a real break, when you begin intermittent fasting, such as eating in a 6-hour window and fasting for 18, your body starts to shift gears, your belly fat begins to melt, your energy starts climbing, your mood lifts, and inflammation begins to fade. But that's just the warm-up. Extended fasting going 24, 48, or even 72 hours without food takes those benefits and supercharges them. In the first 24 hours, your liver starts emptying its glycogen stores all that stored sugar and water gets wrung out like a sponge. You'll see the scale drop, not because of magic fat loss, but because your body is flushing out fluid and beginning to burn fat. By the time you hit day 2, your fuel source has shifted almost entirely to ketones, the clean burning energy your brain loves. This is why people on prolonged fasts report laser focus, elevated mood, and a mental clarity they've never experienced before. Your growth hormone skyrockets by up to 2000%, protecting your muscles and accelerating fat burning at the same time making fasting one of the most powerful fat loss tools on the planet. But it doesn't stop there. Something even more remarkable happens autophagy. This is your body's cellular deep clean mode, where it takes out the trash, breaks down damaged proteins, kills off faulty cells and recycles them into new, healthy tissue. Think of it as a self-cleaning oven for your body and brain. Insulin blocks autophagy but fasting unleashes it. By day 3 of a fast, autophagy goes into overdrive. Your immune system begins clearing out hidden viruses, intracellular pathogens, and even old, malfunctioning immune cells. No drug, no supplement, not even the most. Advanced therapy can do this, yet your body can if you let it. Stem cell production ramps up, your immune defenses reset, and you're literally rebuilding yourself from the inside out. This is why fasting has been linked to better immune function, reduced risk of cancer, improved brain health, and even reversal of autoimmune issues. It's like giving your entire body a full-service upgrade for free. Of course, there's a smart way to do this. During your fast, stick to water, black coffee, or plain tea anything with no calories. Add a pinch of sea salt to your water throughout the day to avoid fatigue, and consider potassium or magnesium if you're low on electrolytes. And when it's time to break your fast, be gentle. Your digestive system needs to wake up slowly. Start with something like bone broth, wait a bit, then move on to steamed vegetables or a soft cooked egg before easing back into your normal meals. The worst thing you can do after a prolonged fast is dive straight into carbs or a huge meal that is a recipe for feeling miserable. The truth is, we've been sold the idea that eating constantly is the key to health. But the science and the results say otherwise. Fasting isn't deprivation, it's restoration. It's your body's chance to reset, repair, and rebuild itself in ways no pill or therapy can match. And once you experience it, you'll never look at skipping a meal the same way again.